Hello boys and girls, welcome back. I'm so happy to see you today. If you're feeling happy today, why don't you do three jumping jacks with me? Are you ready? Three, two, one. Awesome, well done. And guess what? I have a special visitor today. My friend Zama is here. Say hi, Zama. Hi, everyone. I'm so glad you came to join us because today is gonna be a good day. We've got a trampoline, isn't that right? And we love trampoline because it's so much fun. Trampoline is so bouncy that we can jump so high like a grasshopper. Come on boys and girls, can you show me your biggest jump? Yeah, that's so good. Awesome, well done everyone. Those were some pretty big jumps. That was fun. Yes, it was. Now Zama, a trampoline can be so much fun, but if there are no rules, then people can get hurt. What kind of rules do you think we should have? If there are too many people, we might bang each other. That's true. If there's too many people, they might bump into each other and get hurt. So, not too many people on the trampoline at the same time. What else do you think? If we, if we have shoes on the trampoline, we might damage it or hurt someone or sleep. That's true. Wearing shoes on the trampoline can be dangerous. So, no shoes on the trampoline. Yes, Emma, I like the way you think. Now, we might not always want those rules, but they keep us safe so we can keep having fun and not get hurt. That's also why we can trust God's way, because He also wants us to be safe and to be keeping on having fun too. Now, boys and girls, do you remember what we're learning about? I do, but I learned about how God cares for us, for me and you to make good choices. Exactly. And do you know why? Because God's way is perfect. Yes, and He only wants what's best for us. Well done, Zama. Boys and girls, can you that, say that with us? God's way, way is perfect. perfect. That's right, and let's do the actions as we do our memory verse together. God's way is perfect. Second Samuel 22 verse 31. Great job, Bangani Bami. That's correct. God's way is the best way. Even when we have our own ways of doing things, His way is always the best. God is a good dad, and he loves us, so he always knows what's best for us. Now, Zama, I know a great song about how perfect God's ways are. Should we sing it, boys and girls? Let's stand up and sing together. Oh, I've heard a thousand stories of what they but I've heard the tender whisper of love in the dead of night and you tell me that you're pleased and that I'm never alone. You're a good, good father. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who It's who I am. You're a good, good father. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. And I'm loved by you. It's who I am. It's who I am. It's who I am. You're a good, good father. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you 
Okay, Bangani Bami, today's true story from the Bible is about a guy named Jonah. So, Mom, what was his name? Jonah. Yes. One day, God told Jonah to go to Nineveh. If Nineveh was that way, what do you think Jonah did? Did he go God's way? Nope. Sadly not, he didn't. Everyone say, Oh no, Jonah, not that way. Oh no, Jonah, not that way. God told Jonah to go to Nineveh and tell the people there to go God's way. But Jonah didn't want to go to Nineveh. Jonah thought he had a better idea. He wanted to sail on a boat far, far away from Nineveh. Swish, swish, swish. Boys and girls, what do you think Jonah should do? Should he go Jonah's way or jump, jump and go God's way? Can you say it with me? Jump, jump, jump and go, go God's, God's way. way. Well done. Jonah didn't go God's way. Hmm. He didn't like the people in Nineveh, so he didn't want to help them to go God's way. So instead, he got in a boat and sailed in the opposite direction of Nineveh. Jonah wanted to do things his own way instead of God's way. While Jonah was in the boat, a big storm came with wind. Can you rub your hands together like this? That's good. Then it rained. Let's pat our legs like this. It rained more and more and harder and harder. That's good. Bangani Bam. Jonah knew that God sent the storm for him. So in order to save the other people on the boat, he threw himself into the water. Let's jump. You can see it like this. The storm stopped. But then Jonah called out to God and God sent a giant fish to save Jonah from the sea. So there was Jonah inside the tummy of the big fish and he was feeling very sorry for not going God's way. Let's look sorry. So Jonah prayed and he told God he was very sorry he didn't go God's way. Then he praised God and he knew that God's way is perfect. And he knew that he had gone in the opposite direction. When Jonah finished praying, God made the giant fish spit Jonah out onto dry land. Asambe ni bangani bami. Let's jump out like Jonah did, like this. Well done, boys and girls. Jonah finally went to Nineveh. And guess what? The people there decided to go God's way. Isn't that great? He told them all about God, and they decided to follow God's way too. Do you know why, boys and girls? Because God's way is perfect. Sometimes we think we have a better way, but the truth is God's way is perfect. And that's why we can always trust Him. Now let's talk to God and thank Him for all His perfect ways. Let's ask Him to show us His perfect ways and help us always to follow them. Let's close our eyes and fold our hands. Dear God, thank You for loving us. Thank You for loving us when we make mistakes and when we don't. Please help us to know Your good ways. Thank you that you want what's best for us. Help us to trust you and to follow you always. Forgive us for when we've gone our own way. Thank you for your mercy and that you are a good, good father to us. In Jesus' name, Amen! Wow! That was a great story. 
When Jonah was inside the big fish, he finally decided to go God's way. And we can go God's way too, because God's, God's way, way is perfect. perfect. Whose way is perfect? God's way is perfect. That's right. Okay, Bangani, thank you for spending time with us today. I loved spending time with you. Let's jump, jump to go God's way. See you next time, Bangani Bami. Bye. Bye.